My name is Chris Daniel. I'm a Ghanaian from the Volta region, but I was born in Accra here. I'm a product of Accra Tenka Training Center. Uh, I'm into welding and fabrication. Actually, I went through the practical training as an apprentice. Since then, I rejoined a company called Trelido, and I rose to become installation manager and quality control officer. And uh, I decided to start something on my own. I believe in entrepreneurship. I believe in doing something yourself. So I started uh, and start training people in welding and fabrication. Before COVID, we have about five permanent workers and we have uh, six students that are undergoing training. Two of them graduated and they are, they've left, so it's left with uh, three now that's still undergoing training. My name is Mariette Ishak. Um, I'm from Kumasi and I came to Accra to further it on the welding and fabrication. I'm facing some challenges, but it's okay. It's any training, you have to face some challenges before you achieve what you want. Yeah, sometimes uh, if I say that I'm, I want to be a welder, say, some people say, a woman, how can you be a welder? How can you be a welder? How can you marry and those stuff? If you get, give birth, how are we going to take care of your child? And those kind of questions, plenty of questions they ask. And I said, oh, I can do it, I can do it. I just told them I can do it. This cannot um, put me back. Now I'm almost um, at the letter part. Maybe for the year to end, I'll get to finish. Yeah, I want to be my, I want to have my own um, business. Yeah, I want, to, I want to have my own business, like fabrication of um, um, chairs, bears, those kind of things. So I want to work on the field to get much capital so that I will start on this job. Yeah. I want to um, weld better. I wanted to um, weld better like um, those who are higher level, yeah. So in our field, about between seven to 10% of female that you can find in our area of work. Yeah. Mostly is male dominated. When people see Maria to, in my workshop, they become so amazed and say, wow. What a, a bold lady, because it's not every lady that can stand that boldness to be among male-dominated field. My message to young women who want to go into Tibet is that they should go with every boldness. They should never entertain any fear. They shouldn't give room for fear. Yes, fear is an enemy. They should go with every boldness. Whatever you want to do in Tibet, go. I want to encourage my um, other girls to follow my first step. And um, this job is not all that difficult. I want to encourage them to get into the job. Yeah, I want to encourage them into the job so that women will be shine and shine wherever we go. The young ladies out there, they should come and learn welding and fabrication. I think that's my aspect. And I'm happy to be a welder, I'm happy. I'm glad, it's not like I'm just saying it. I'm happy to be a welder.